Hello and welcome back to Here We Tow. Today I'm going to be having a closer look at this. It's the Mark II e-bike. It's an electric bike. This model is the Mark II Scrambler 430 CX. It is a trekking bike and it's their latest edition. Now, just to be completely clear here, this Mark II bike, it has been sent to me. It is on loan. I don't get to keep it. I'm not being paid to talk about this bike. And I actually asked Mark II if I could have two bikes from them, having previously used them before, so we could use them with the motorhome. And the reason I asked Mark II if I could have some bikes to use is because these are excellent quality. Mark II, it's a UK company, and these bikes are made from parts made in Denmark. So what do we need to know about the Mark II Scrambler CX430? Well, this bike, it's got a 17 inch frame, so it's perfect for me because I am small. Now, if you've got an inside leg from 28 inches to 36, you'll be fine on this bike. They do have a larger model if you want a 19 inch frame. Um, it does come as the 480 CX. Now, the frames are available in yellow, like mine, and I asked for yellow, I just love this, um, or black, which is a, a little bit more sedate. The frame itself comes, um, it's aluminium, and you get a five-year warranty on this frame, and these bikes are absolutely solid. Because it is an e-bike, it is heavy. Now, this particular model, uh, with the battery on, weighs just over 26 kilograms. Now, I've been out on this bike, I've done 17 miles on this bike and then I've done a trip of 26 miles on this bike. So I've done quite a lot of mileage on it and what I can say is even though I'm small and I don't weigh a lot, I've not struggled with the weight of the bike so don't worry about that if you're lighter like myself. What else do we need to know? Well, the motor on the bike, this is a totally UK road legal bike. It's a 250 watt motor and the bike has 10 Shimano gears. It also has, as we can see, the front suspension. I've never had a bike with front suspension and I really do like it. If you're not so keen though, you can actually lock the suspension. Um, there's a button on the handlebars here to lock or unlock the front suspension. So you can change it if you don't like that. You also get the control panel here. So this will show you how much charge you've got in your battery. It takes four to six hours to charge the battery on the Scrambler CX. Now, when I did my 17 mile trip, I only used two bars out of my electric. So it will go for miles. And when I did 26, I'd use three bars. So you don't need to worry about how far, how far you can go. I reckon, I reckon I could probably do probably 60 miles nearly on this bike on a full charge. Um, we, you get a bell, ding, not had to use that yet. That's an emergency situation, is that? You do get a light, an LED light. You also get the uh, mud guards on the front and the rear, as we can see, they come as standard. Now, the front tire on, these, on this uh, bike, you do get a quick release, which you, the, um, the action for that is on this side here. So it's a quick release front wheel. So for storage in the motorhome, you can take the front wheel off and you can also take the rear wheel you've got a quick release here on the rear wheel I've not actually taken my rear wheel off so I'm, I don't know how easy that is to operate I've not had to take that off for storage purposes these tires now if you're worried about punctures you do actually have the safeguard puncture protection so if you get something in your tire it will stop you having a deflation so at least you can pedal back to where you're going um, and then obviously you would have to I presume repair your tire um, you do get a stand as we can see here so when you're out and about and you pop in to get cake and ice cream you can leave your bike stood up then another feature is this rack so this rack here will take um, up to 27 kilos um, as part of the total weight the bike will carry again I have used that and I've strapped with a, a bungee um, a bag to take all my kit the actual weight the bike will take the scrambler um, CX is up to 120 kilos um, which is just under 19 stones so that's probably most people Jules has been on it it will take Jules as well so no problem I'm tapping the saddle because you can get a number of extras on the um, the CX 
This saddle is the comfort saddle, so I chose this one. You can get a more narrow saddle if you want, but if you're doing a bit of distance, you'll soon feel it on your back end. So this is um, probably something I'd recommend for comfort. The handlebars now, these are the straight handlebars. Again, I prefer the straight handlebars. If you go on the Mark II website, again, I'll put a link down there, um, you can get more of a, a, a bent handlebar. Um, you might prefer that. So yeah, have a look at your options, but I prefer straight personally. So that basically is the Mark II Scrambler 430 CX. The yellow frame, the comfort saddle, um, the straight handlebars. As I say, it's got puncture protection. We've got a really good warranty on it. It is made from parts made in Europe as opposed to Chinese parts. Really good range on the bike. Absolutely solid manufacturing. The price of this model, now this is a new model for this year, this bike is £2,399. So in terms of the e-bike market, this is a higher end. It's, it's designed to compete with the higher end manufacturers. Having used it and, and me uh, Mark II previously, I would absolutely recommend these bikes. There is a discount available. We've got a code, as we always do. Um, if you want 10% off any Mark II e-bike on their website, you can enter the code HWT10 and get 10% off. What you can also do, if you order a Mark II, um, they will come almost fully made. You just have to add um, bits and pieces, I think like your pedals and things like that. Um, but they do have a service where it actually comes fully um, set up for you and that's how we actually got our e-bikes so if you want to have them fully set up literally ready to get on and ride you can pay a little extra for that but have a look on their website so there we go I have just done a review of the bike because I asked Mark II if they would let me have one and they have for a short period of time and I'm absolutely loving it I've done Tissington Trail part of the High Peak Trail the Cinder Track and coming up I've got Rutland Water but yeah, absolutely brilliant e-bikes. So code below for 10% off. If you want to find out more, visit their website. I'm going to uh, give mine a clean up and prepare for my next trip. So there we go. Hopefully you've enjoyed that. Quick look around an e-bike for you. So as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.